All right, we have a question here. What is education for sustainability? Okay, New Roots Charter School. Don't say I never do commercials here. I'm not getting any money. Am I collecting a check from New Roots Charter School? To, to my your knowledge? knowledge, no. Okay. New Roots Charter School empowers, empowers, not teach, empowers students to be solutionaries for sustainability. No, I know that word. Solutionaries. I know that word. It's, uh, solutionaries? It's, uh, it's, I think it's coined by the Institute for Humane Education. Yeah, I'm actually an advisor for that organization. <laughs> I know uh, them too. They're called clueless fucking morons. <laughs> solutionaries? No! Solutionaries. Solutionary, yeah, not, yeah. not solutionaires. Solutionaries. Yes. Like little, little uh, solution fairies. Anyway, okay. Education for sustainability. No poverty. So suddenly tomorrow, every person on this fucking planet has the disposable income of all of us clueless fucking morons paying six to five dollars to be here reading this or sign. Or free if you volunteer. So, yeah. No poverty. That would destroy the planet in one night. The planet would be dead. There would be no humans on the planet. If, uh, if there was no poverty on the planet. Do you agree with that statement, David Simonson? Uh, there, is, there is some truth to that. There is some truth to that. That if everybody, there was no poverty in the next 24 hours, the planet would be dead within the week. It would be devoured pretty quickly. All right, we agree on that. Zero hunger, well, that follows. When, when uh, it, yes, I'm not even gonna go there. Good health and well-being, everything about this is very, uh, human-centric economic growth comes in at number eight so economic growth coming in at number eight for uh, solutions for sustainability uh, more economic growth uh, yes. that's what we're teaching the children but it but it's down number eight okay it's it's, it's like that it's less important than gender equality so <laughs> that's good that's number five all right Economic growth coming in at number eight. Well, by that logic, look at Industry what, and look infrastructure some, coming in at number bottom. nine. Okay, yeah, well, we're getting to that. We're getting to that. Ten, reduced inequalities. Sustainable cities. Responsible consumption. Okay. Number 13, climate action. Okay! Coming in at number 14, life below water. Coming in at number five, gender equality. Coming in at number 14, life below Who water. Who needs life below water? Really? I mean, we don't live below Well, that's why you got to push life on land to the 15th most important thing. On the, the 15th most important subject to teach the solutionaries for sustainability is that life on land is the 15th place. Uh, that well, 14 more subjects are more important than life on land. Well, once you get rid of all the life on land, <laughs> you'll have achieved gender equality. Well, you will uh, <laughs> certainly have uh, achieved peace and justice for the first fucking time in human yeah. history. There'll be zero hunger when humans are extinct. I thought that said partnership for the gorillas. <laughs> Those, oh, sponsored by the UN right, right. Sustainable Development Goal. That's what I to do with me. All right. Anyway, has she started? I don't know. I forgot where I was going. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember where the beard 